Well, the world has been stunned by the story of a toddler run down by two hit-and-run drivers in southern China. The little girl's now in a hospital bed clinging to life as the nation grapples with questions about moral decline in a fast-changing society. Our Eunice Yoon went to check on the girl's condition and to speak with her family and friends. A limp body, barely recognizable at this hospital in southern China. Her mother hoping two-year-old Wang Yue might wake if she calls her name. Chu Fei Fei has barely slept since her daughter was critically injured in not one but two hit-and-run accidents. Ye Ye won't disappoint everyone, she says. I know my girl. She's strong. A security camera in this bustling hardware market caught the accidents on tape. The footage shows the little girl wandering in front of a white van. She's hit, run over, and run over again by another vehicle. The video was posted online, outraging the public. But these are the scenes that sparked nationwide soul searching. Over a dozen pedestrians, motorists, and bikers pass by the bleeding child and do nothing. The hit and run accidents happened here in an alleyway near Wang's father's hardware store. She lay on the ground for about 10 minutes before a good Samaritan moved her here to safety. Chen Shan Mei was that unexpected hero, a street scavenger who stepped in to save a life, now a symbol of understated decency, a quality many fear is increasingly rare in a nation obsessed with moving up the economic ladder. I didn't think of anything at the time, she told local reporters. I just wanted to save the girl. Chen's neighbors told us she appeared overwhelmed by her instant celebrity and has since gone home to the countryside. Granny Chen represents the best part of human nature, Chu says. I thank her for that. Wang Yue is still very much in critical condition. Her mother says that she has some sensation in her lower body, but she has very little brain activity. Despite the concerns of China's declining morality, here at the hospital, humanity shines. During our short visit, Wang's family received a steady procession of well-wishers, bearing gifts, money and comfort for someone they never knew. Wang's mother appreciates the support, but is hoping to receive the best gift of all. Don't give up on mom, she tells her girl. Mom is not giving up. Let mom have one more chance to love and spoil you. Eunice Yoon, CNN, Guangzhou.